So this is officially the May um, edition of the CentOS Board of Directors meeting. Um, we do have quorum, but I do not know, think we have anything on the agenda that would require quorum. Um, we have a link in the agenda of the previous minutes. And the one um, agenda item I did kind of carry over from last week's, last month's meeting was the CentOS Stream 8 end of life communications. And I called this agenda item a follow up. I just want to make sure that everyone knew what had occurred. Um, Adam had volunteered to send this email out um, and he did so. And I sent a, a reply of support um, from myself and the board you know, on his email. Um, if anyone feels like we need a link to that in the agenda, I will track it down after the meeting and put it in here. As far as ongoing um, discussion, we really don't have any. So I'm gonna skip down to issues. And number 125 was the board activity clarity and governance. Um, this was done since the last meeting. So I will close that out um, later today but I did want to bring that up at this meeting. Um, we, I selected two um, random issues. One is number 122, the Get, Get org. Actually, I don't need to read the link to you, never mind that. The document offboarding retirement process for CentOS SIGs. Um, Pat, you were working on that. Is there a status update on that? Uh, I think we just need to merge it into our official governance documents so that it's written down that the process is without it being in this ticket here that we'll lose track of it. Okay, have you put in a document for PR or are we still at need to move that over? I thought I had, but I don't see one open. So maybe I forgot. Okay, when you get that done, can you put the PR number in the um, issue and then we'll get that merge can do thank you the other one i selected was number 116 also to send to us irc channels need to be bridged with matrix before july 25th uh, well no 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 this isn't that you thought this was the the bridges i don't yeah. think ever got done on the Fedora side and they're broken. Yeah, the bridges don't work. So I think it's more of a discussion of do we want to keep this open? Um, just add some notes to close it out or just do we want to just keep it updated and open? So there's ongoing discussion on the Fedora side on the matrix deployment uh, they have. And I think depending on how that resolves, that will influence possibly what we end up doing for matrix for CentOS. Um, I would probably leave this open to track. Okay, can you add those notes into it? We sorting get a that out. Um, I can. We can also just grab Justin later and see where we're at with that. Okay, let me just put a slight note in. Um, but yeah, for the bridges specifically, the bridges do not work and will never work again. So, do we need a different ticket about the matrix if the bridges are never going to be done? Or just keep um, it all all the work on this one ticket. We could make another ticket if folks prefer. Either is fine by me. Um, if we put the notes in here and maybe rename this, at least we'll have the history. So let's go ahead and do that. And I'm right, trying to write what you just said in the agenda. Yeah, if you want something to reference, uh, Fedora has a council ticket open, I believe, to sort okay. out matrix on there and. I like your keyboard. Yeah, I like the laptop. You said there's a council to get up with? I believe so, yeah. Uh, okay. We can we'll check with Justin afterwards and follow up.
Okay, that's all I had as far as so Sean, it's up to your community architect update. Mm -hmm. Okay, sorry, I was just trying to look at that council ticket. Um, I don't have much. We are here at Red Hat Summit, which is why it's four of us are in our a room together. So uh, we have a booth here shared with with Fedora, and things are going well. And having I think really good conversations about about uh, Fedora and CentOS um, um, with people. We had um, yesterday, no, Monday, before yesterday, Monday was a community day, which was a new thing that got added to Red Hat Summit. Um, and we had a, a block of various uh, kind of Fedora and CentOS related talks. So um, Davina talked uh, along with um, Michelle about the, the hyperscale SIG. Um, Jeff Rowe and, and uh, Pierre were talking about automotive. And we had Brian Stenson uh, giving a, a presentation about um, kind of what's upcoming in, in CentOS Stream 10. So that went really well. And then, also had a block of Fedora talks as well. Um, and we've got a, a little mini theater um, on the expo floor hall. Um, and we've had, uh, Dada again was with with uh, Michelle and um, Neil did a hyperscale kind of demo there. And, and again, Jeffro and Pierre did a automotive thing. And, and I gave a kind of a, like a quick whirlwind tour of all the uh, the CentOS 6 in that one. So, um, those are all going over well. The other thing is um, Flock. The CFP has closed, uh, and the I think the CFP review period is it's over. Is just just ended. I think yesterday, uh, and so you should be able to expect to see start seeing some um, acceptances going out uh, for that fairly soon. Um, there's a team on that, but of course, the, Justin is the main person in charge of it, and he's here at Summit too, and is also busy. So. Um, you know, maybe next week, but we should we should see those coming out soon. So um, I think that's all I have. Yep. Does anyone uh, have it? Go ahead, Pat. Sorry. Uh, will the slides for those community talks be up somewhere? I'd love to look over them. I will gladly upload mine. Um, is there a place to I'm, I'm happy to upload slides for the ones I did. I didn't see any communication that there no, was a place to upload things. No, and I've thought about it because we didn't really have a place for the ones for like CentOS Connect. Uh, and one thing I thought might be because we used to just upload them to the wiki and use that as a dumping ground. And I thought, could we maybe just use like a GitLab repo yeah, somewhere? Yeah, we could put them just, one. Yeah. And we could maybe make a plan for the new updated website yeah. to yeah. have a pass toss section. And that could either have links to talks on YouTube yeah. or links to slides. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, for what is worth, for a hyperscale, we have a page in our docs that links all the talks that we gave or that oh, yeah. people in the related community gave, and usually links to the videos. Or if there's if the conference has like a page for the event, it links to that too. Yeah. But not all of them have slides. But we don't have a place to keep slides. Yeah. I think having a slide for all the Okay, I'll set that up. And we can either do those as PDFs or if people I are. Have, I mean, whatever. It would be difficult if people have like. Google Docs ones, but you can do a PDF export. I, I think doing PDFs is easiest now yeah. that most people use yeah. Google Slides. Yeah. And then if somebody wants to, really likes your talk and they'd like to ask you for their deck to use it in the future, kind of like when we were walking over here and we had the discussion yeah. of it would be great if we had that SIG overview and a little intro to the, yep. yeah. then we could have maybe there a, a deck that people can use. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep, that's a good idea. Okay. So, let me just put some notes. I keep forgetting to move the cursor. So please bear with me. They did not record the community day talks, which I was. They recorded audio. They recorded audio. Do you I don't know, really what? know if they're publishing it or not? Okay. But like listening to audio of a talk yeah. that's designed to have slides is. The mini theater didn't have any recording no. at all, mm -hmm. as far as I could tell. No, trying to record on an Expo Flow no, theater is... The audio was already challenging as yeah, it were. Because yeah. <laughs> we've been talking about having that canned presentation that people can use. Yeah. Um, yeah. And yeah, and also things like the packaging workshop that Carol runs, I think, is another one that's mm -hmm. a good, like, 
then the multiple people can potentially run at the conference if you don't want to. I no. guess I could add that to the things happening here. Carl George it will be delivering a packaging workshop tomorrow. Um, it's the same kind of pack of workshop he did at, at scale and some other things that always goes over really well. I'm trying to with me, everyone. I don't want to say canned presentations in labs. Can anyone else think of a better word? Pat, you're usually the uh, wordsmith. Prepared. Uh, yeah, prepared, pre-generated, uh, default, provided, example. I like, I like prepared. Okay, perfect. All right, so do we have any other business? Does anyone want to bring something up for discussion? Or any questions or concerns about what's been going on this week in further detail? All righty, then this is going to be a really short meeting. Thank you everyone for joining. And we will see you in June. Take care. Take care. Bye. Bye, all. Bye everyone. Yes.